Earlier today, I made a video showing how to add nameplates to the health bar setup that I did earlier this week. And there was a great comment where I learned something and I thought it was really important that I just share it with everybody. It's quick and I think really useful. So in the code, one of the things that I use is a list of tuples, just so I didn't have to create a struct with names. I've got a list of tuples of nameplate and character and it's named nameplate. It should be named nameplates because it's plural. Now the comment was simply, why don't you use the other format here to do it so that you don't have to use item one and item two. Now this other format here is the value tuple system with named members. I didn't know this existed. It looks like it appeared in 2017, right around when I was all in Unity and it did not support .NET 7 at the time. But now it does and we can use these. Let's see what it looks like with that. If I replace the tuples with a list of, here we go, of value tuples, and then I look down at my code where I'm using them, I can then use things like, well, let's see, the plates.nameplate, and these, these names are terrible. Let's call this plate. The plate.nameplate, and then this would be, instead of item one, it would turn into the um, nameplate position. And here I want to use the character position. See, this actually helps. I get names in here and I can avoid bugs. So again, this is just like using a um, tuple, except if you do it with parentheses instead of a new tuple, then you can actually name the parameters and you can use those named parameters. I thought this was really cool. I didn't know about this, so thank you very much for the comment. Rue Social, I think it is. And if you have any other comments, you guys got thoughts, uh, things that I missed or anything like that, drop them down below. I'd love to hear them and just see if there's something useful that we can all learn from and then share that all out with everybody. All right, thanks again. I'll see you in the next video. Oh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and check out the uh, links in the description below for the courses and all that stuff. Bye. Oh, before I go, since I'm putting out a bunch of videos now, I decided to start making them members only first so that the members who've been around for a long time can get a little something special while I space these out. And I also wanted to just say a special thanks to some members along the way, including let's, let's just start with the two who've been around the longest, Rob George, Thank you very much, Rob. And uh, Vendolis, I'm not sure exactly how you pronounce it, but again, thank you everybody who's been a member and just been around supporting the channel for a long time. Really appreciate it. And again, I'm going to start making a bunch of things members only first, so you'll get a quick preview of that, or at least a, a couple hour preview of things before everybody else. So thanks again, everybody. Otherwise, oh, don't forget, just don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.